All right. So first, I'd like to apologize for how I sound. Um, <coughs> I've got cold or something. Not COVID, thankfully. I hope I've taken tests and it doesn't seem to be. But yeah. And uh, second of all, I've been reading all the comments um, from the previous vid, which is up there, and uh, it seems like um, some of you saying it still doesn't work for you on Plutifer. So I'm gonna try and try show. <coughs> I've got a ROM PC now because uh, Plutifer is actually having a free weekend, so you're gonna sign up uh, if you haven't on their Pluto API thing and uh, create an account, and for the weekend you'll be able to. Blutosphere. So you want to have, um, once you have your ROM and you've been added, you want to download the Oculus. Here, so you want to want to have download the Oculus software, you want to have virtual desktop, then download it afterwards. Um, <clears throat> and I believe you need to do this method first before you try anything else. Uh, so this is a ROM device, as I said, so therefore it's completely fresh and it won't be using my persistent one that I have, uh, the other one I have. So, uh, you will need it all installed, this bit, Roblox installed obviously, uh, Steam VR, obviously working in Steam, uh, I mean, um, logged in. <coughs> so, um, you're gonna have the Oculus thing, you don't need to link to your headset, <coughs> like, to the actual home thing. But, okay, I, I just... Um, so you will need to go to settings after you've got all of this set up, go to the general and have unknown sources. This will allow games outside the store to obviously work, like Roblox. So then you'll obviously want to, once this is all done, you'll want to go to your, um, you want to go to your Roblox, you want to check out a game, so we're going to do this because that's the easiest one for me. And lots of people have it, if you'll click. There we go. Uh, you can see Steam VR opened, but there is missing some things here. So if we were to go on it now, Roblox start up. It should, uh, it will open up as a flat screen, and obviously I'm gonna have to quickly delete that as I don't want to get striked or anything. Um, <coughs> but it is in VR, so what you're gonna want to do is exit Steam on Pluto virtual, um, and you'll go launch it again. No, that shouldn't have done that. See that that's there. I've obviously scuffed it up a bit. Um, like, um, actually, it should work. If you'll switch, let me come on, come on, stop. Switch the desktop. Then you want to want to start VR hands. You want to make sure this is exactly showing. So you want to delete, not delete it, but from, and then rejoin it, and um. This should hopefully show up, and you want to switch to VR, and it doesn't want to work. <coughs> right. So you want to exit to VR because that doesn't work, obviously. Um. So instead, you want to want to have it here ready. You want to click play. You want to play launch Steam VR right afterwards. <coughs> and as you can see here. It put me in, in VR mode. So, let me get my hands to show. There we go. And yeah, we're in Roblox VR. We'll play and uh, voila. Six. Okay, sorry. Um, oh, oh, I don't remember what. Um, but yeah, you've got Roblox VR working now, so. It's a start. So, if you come off now. Uh, look. Exit game. <coughs> and you'll end up uh, back here. So, if you were to just do it inside here, desktops, instead of um, the, what's it called? 
uh, virtual desktop. So this is now for the Pluto client. Afterwards, after you've done virtual desktop, um, you should be able to come on here and it should start robot player up and it puts you in there so in the end, uh you have a virtual desktop running uh robot should be up running and ta-da that is it <coughs> things to remember uh you want to press this and then launch VR literally right afterwards. So let's just show you once again quickly. Press game. It's loading. Launch Team VR right afterwards. And it should put you in as put unknown sources on your Oculus thing. <coughs> and it hasn't done that. But yes, it's, it's breaking on me. It's a bit sketchy, but that's how you do it. <coughs> that's explanatory to virtual desktop. So we're gonna exit Steam VR. Here. We're gonna launch it, not without the game. We're gonna go here, and then we are going to check to our, to our desktops. See that thing's there now. You know, I click play. And voila, it works again. Uh, cool, that is it. That's that's what I wanted to do. Uh, so we're gonna exit game, and yeah, that is everything. So <coughs> obviously, I've tried to take edit and upload this end of Saturday. And um, obviously, so you have an extra day. Yeah, that extra day. Uh, so Sunday to play, test things out. Um, and obviously, remember, please play giveaway down below in the link in the in the description. Can't think because of my cold. And uh, basically, after free weekend, um, you won't be able to play it anymore. But if you win the giveaway, you'll be able to play it until the uh, well, quite a bit until um. Pulisphere releases and I don't believe that's going to be happening anytime soon so if you win then uh, you'll get Pulisphere access get a skip the queue and get it for free so official requirement you've got to subscribe because I'm cool you're cool and I'm and cool people work together you know game it's game and you're going to want to respect me by to me because I'm released to 1k four more 400 uh, less than 400 now so I'm on 600 and something but yeah that is it for this video, so make sure to like and uh, the VR game.